Here are the three ways you can get your video files off the DJI Osmo Pocket 3. The first is going to be down here with the micro SD slot. You pop this card out, put it into a card reader, and away you go. Don't do this. I read a post on Reddit last night. Somebody struggled to get this out, scratched the surface of the micro SD card, lost an entire day's worth of footage. Absolute nightmare. There is probably never a reason in this day and age to be putting in and removing a micro SD card when they give you so many options to get your video files off the Osmo Pocket 3. The easiest way and the way I would recommend is to just grab a USB-C cable straight in the back. What that's going to do, that's going to connect directly to your computer. We go into file transfer mode. And then on our computer, we can see the drive right there. So this is the same thing as reading the SD card, but instead of reading it through a reader, we're just going directly through the USB connection on the DJI Osmo. So you go into your DJI folder, and then here are all of the video and audio files on the DJI Osmo. The next way you can do this, I'm gonna go ahead and unplug this. is through the DJI Osmo app. So you fire up the app. It's going to find and connect to your DJI Osmo Pocket 3. Just give that a few seconds and then once it's connected, you'll see the live preview. From here, if you go to the home, you want to go to albums. There is all of the media on the DJI Osmo Pocket 3 on your phone. Now saving them from your phone to your camera roll, you just tap and then click the save in the top right. So that's the easiest and safest way to get your media and your video files off the DJI Osmo Pocket 3. Do not, unless you have to, once you've got this in, do not remove and replace and remove and replace. The SD, micro SD slot on the DJI Osmo Pocket 3 is temperamental to say the least. On one of the videos I saw explaining how to do this, he actually used a SIM card removal tool and he was prying because he didn't have a fingernail to get in there and pop it out. If that SIM tool or your nail scratches the, the data side of the micro SD card, it's going to scuff that micro SD card and any of the data that's on there. Don't do this. Just plug it straight into USB. Use this as well. The other good thing about the... Uh, the Osmo Pocket 3 is you've got this like little add-on thing on the bottom. So you're not plugging all the time. So you're not directly plugging into the DJI Osmo itself. So this USB port here isn't getting wear and tear because you're going to be doing this quite often. So go through the little tripod extension here. And if you have to get it another way, go through the app on your phone. Hope this helps. I've been UK. You've been fantastic. I will see you in the next one.